gnome And my thoughts keep telling me to get me home But my balls keep telling me to let me oh Oh, just let me oh How's it going lads, Marshall here and welcome to another Inform Review. Now today we've got the Barcelona striker, the Argentinian god, Lionel Messi. Now I couldn't afford him myself so my friend BHD, he lent me his account so thank you so much to him. Guys, I'll leave his channel in the description below. Go check Beach out because he produces some quality, quality content and a sub would mean that you say thank you for letting me use his account for this review for you guys. So anyways, he's costing 2.8 million on the Xbox. 3.5 million on the PlayStation. He's got a four-star skill set, a three-star weak foot, and medium to low work rates. Now, in terms of stats, fan bloody tastic. 94 attack and positioning, acceleration of 97, sprint speed of 90. The only kind of letdown with, between all of his stats is 60 strength and poor regression. That is the only kind of letdowns. 97 ball control, 97 dribbling, 96 finishing. Everything just looks beautiful. B E A beautiful. It just looks sen bloody sensational. Shot power is great as well. Volleys, long shots, you name it. He is good at it. And just check out this for the first goal of this review. 35 yards out. Goalkeeper, eat your heart out. You're never saving that. Just look at the replay. The bend, the curve, the swerve, whatever you want to call it. The accuracy overall is great. And it's right in the top corner, in off the crossbar. Goalkeeper has no chance in hell of saving those kind of shots. Now, on this game, dribbling is the main kind of factor in the play. It's the main improvement and Lionel Messi, he is ridiculously good at dribbling. 97 ball control, 97 dribbling. It just means that skill dribble is made for Lionel Messi. Now, skill dribble's been here for roughly two FIFAs. I think it was here on FIFA 13 and FIFA 14. Now, it's still here on this game. It's LTRT and it's so easy to utilize with Lionel Messi. Now, what this does is let you change direction very, very fast when you're in a sprint. So, if you're in a sprint running in one kind of diagonal line and you press LTRT and go in the opposite direction, my good God, the defender's got no chance of challenging you. And Lionel Messi, he can do this so easily. So that is what I suggest to you. If you do use Messi on this game, use skill dribble. That is the main kind of factor I want to kind of push across to you in this video. Use skill dribble with Lionel Messi. The other pros that he does possess, dribble and fantastic. Fantastic ball control is out of this world. Honestly, it's ridiculous. His acceleration is he's basically hitting top speed 0 to 60 in 2.5 seconds. He's hitting his top speed. So top speed is another pro. Finishing fantastic in the area, outside of the area, 30 yards out, 40 yards out. He can score from anywhere on the pitch. His long shots are fantastic and his agility. His agility, he's like a bloody ballerina, honestly, ballerina on ice, one bloody bricks or something like that, he's just so, he's just, he's like a swan, he's like a flamingo, he just balances so well, his agility is fantastic, honestly lads, he skips past challenge within a blink of an eye, the defenders just have no chance on this planet to even challenge him. And the only con is his strength, and that is if you can touch him. So it is a minor, minor con. Now, in terms of who is better, in for Messi or Pele? For me, Pele. He sets the kind of targets on this game. He got a 10 out of 10. Lionel Messi, he's not going to get a 10 out of 10. He's going to get slightly lower simply because his strength is a minor con. A minor, minor con. I must stress that. So for me, Lionel Messi is getting a 9.9, .9, guys. Smash the thumbs up on this video, subscribe if you're not already subscribed, and I will catch you all next time.